Hey, YouTube Brando here. I've been wanting to do this video for a while. I wanted to uh, cook something on the hobo stove. Uh, we tested it and just did some water in it. and We've had a couple fires in it here and there, but we've never cooked anything on it. And I figured uh, now is as good a time as any since Low Buck's doing his uh, stove tech contest. Uh, I would love a stove tech. Those things are awesome. Uh, I'm just not going to go out and spend the money on one because, hell, I'm broke. So if I can win one, that'd be cool. Uh, I've been trying to get a fire started here, so this is take two. Uh, this thing's being a pain in the ass. It's really windy out today, and it's been raining down here for about the past uh, well, three weeks, so it's pretty damn. Uh, bear with me here. fire built up and then I'll be back YouTube. Hi right, YouTube. Uh, got my fire built up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cook some uh, black eyed peas on here. Uh, we're having steaks tonight. Black eyed peas and rice. So I figured I'd come out here and cook the black eyed peas. Take a crap load of wood. I already know that this thing burns wood like there's no tomorrow. So, but I got my fire built up. I got my pot. I got my beans. And I got my water. So I'll come back when I get it all set up and uh, show you where we're at. All right, we're back. Uh, we got my beans in there. Got my water in there, about a liter of water and about a half pound of beans. Uh, definitely gonna have to add water to it. Hopefully they don't cook up too hot. Uh, got a decent fire going. Uh, see how long it takes to get it done. I was gonna cook pinto beans, but pinto beans take all damn day. So uh, I went with some black eyed peas. Hopefully they won't take too long. And, uh, I'll be back as soon as it starts boiling. So my beans uh, started to soak up most of my water. I had to add more water and uh, need to cut more wood, but you can see it's been about three minutes, three and a half minutes, and that water's already boiling. So, and that's how much wood we've already been through. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and cut up some more wood. As soon as these things get about done, we'll come back and show you what we have. Alright, we're back. Uh, sorry about the cutting in and out on this video, but uh, I can only make a 10 minute video on YouTube, so I'm having to cut in and out. Actually, uh, these beans soaked up about 90% of that water, so I had to add more water. <clears throat> They're pretty soft now. Uh, so what we're going to do is, is we're going to let this fire die down and go ahead and let them finish uh, cooking in the water we just added. And when that water gets down a little bit, we're going to take them inside and put them in the slow cooker uh, to keep them warm. 
while we finish uh, cooking the rest of our meal. We're going to cook some rice and some steaks and stuff. So <clears throat> These are just about done. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys that the hobo stove actually does work. It does use a shitload of wood. You can see uh, we're using these fence planks. And this is all that's left is of one, and we use the entire uh, section of another one that was broken in half. So he used uh, about an entire fence plank just to cook a uh, half pound of beans and, and maybe two liters of water. So uh, it'll burn through some wood. I, I don't deny that, but it does work very well. And I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I hope I did everything right for your contest, low buck. If not, let me know, and uh, I'll resubmit a new video. Appreciate you watching. All right.